Several stakeholders in the electoral process in Imo State are gathered here to brainstorm on ways to guarantee credible and peaceful conduct of the forthcoming governorship election in Imo State holding November. They provide solutions on several ways to manage the election to ensure a successful outcome. The overall objective of this forum is to create an interactive platform to engage critical stakeholders. That's all of you here as peace builders before, during, and after the cell, after the off cycle election. There are other objectives that will unfold as this interaction progresses. Today's event is critical, especially as it has to do with a build-up to the 2023 off-cycle elections in the United States. And for us, Petros, we believe so much that there is no better state, especially for all the new state, than the state we call our own. And there is no better country than the country we call our own, a country, Nigeria. But the stakeholders also expressed worry over the way politicians and other VIPs in the state have behaved during election days by using security operatives to intimidate opponents. They want the security agencies and staff of the Independent National Electoral Commission to maintain their neutrality. For instance, political parties don't plan for election. They plan for violence. They budget for it. If you go to their offices, and why do they do that? They don't have anything to sell to the public. Until we actually, of course, Simo State somehow have been prone to violence. And that's why it's so necessary that the issue of peace starts early enough to be talked about. And that's why we are here. Yeah. But it's beyond sitting down and talking. It is what we do with the process, the impact, the outcome of this process that really transcends to real peace that can be sustained. And for me, we should look at the problem of how to deal with our diverse population. The two-day consultative stakeholders meeting put together by the Kuka Center in partnership with other, with other groups in Imo State also urged the citizen to have faith in the electoral system again so as to ensure a huge turnout of voters during the election. 